Lots of beef cattle being housed at the moment. This week I'm talking about a very popular housing treatment for parasites. The injection combination of ivermectin and chlorcelon. So that's a wormer and a flucoside together. So we can give it to beef cattle only in Ireland. It's a mil per 50 kilos of a dose. So a 500 kilo store going into the shed is going to be getting a 10 mil dose. And in a 250 mil pack size, that's going to be 25 doses. You're looking at a 66 day meat withdrawal with Animex Super and for me it's perfect as a housing treatment in a low fluke risk area. If you're in a higher fluke risk area, you might have younger fluke than the chlorcelon will treat, active in the livers, damaging the livers. So you might need to opt for something that treats that younger fluke. In terms of worms, it's going to kill all your important internal worms, your lung worms, all types of ostertagia and caperia. In terms of externals, it's going to have good efficacy against lice and mange mites. Depending on the winter we get, you might need a follow-up treatment with a synthetic pyrotroid, so look for ingredients that end in metrin. Animex Super is going to be a subcutaneous injection, so that's under the skin. So in practical terms, you're packing your animals good and tightly into your chute, you're walking along the chute, pulling up the skin behind the front shoulder, injecting into that pocket. Make sure you massage the injection site after so you've got no leakage, because that constitutes an underdose if you've got a solution leaking out of the animal. In terms of a gun, you want a good uh, automatic injector gun. Make sure it's filling correctly. Make sure your connection with your bottle is good. If you're given a 10 mil dose or more, split the dose across both sides of the animal. Um, in terms of a needle, for me it's a 16 gauge needle, not longer than two quarters of an inch because you're not trying to get down into the muscle, you're just going under the skin. Um, never, ever, as with all treatments, never underdose. So if you're housing with an adult flucoside like Animex Super, it's important that you follow up just before turnout in springtime to make sure you've got a full clean out and prevent any fluke problems later next year, okay? So that can involve one of two things, either taking a faecal egg sample from a number of animals in the group to see if you've got any fluke eggs there, or another adult flucoside the likes maybe of ruminal.